Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video, we'll be taking a look at Kiribox's recent post about Mayhem 2.0. Now, I've had quite the concerns about this. A lot of us are, actually. Um, mostly because of how Gearbox has been doing things lately, especially with the modifier system, because I don't think Gearbox wants to admit that they're kind of wrong, and I honestly do not like the modifier system at all. I'm glad that they explained it in here, but uh, most of us as a community do not like modifiers, um, especially considering that they said right here that um, you can kind of re-roll until you can get the same modifier. So that kind of removes some difficulty. But they did release a post detailing everything and how every Mayhem level has different types of modifiers. For example, Mayhem level 1 only has easy modifiers. 2 has medium, you know, 3 has easy, medium, medium, and 4 has easy, hard. Now, looking at this, um, we can probably tell that Mayhem 8 looks the, the most optimal one, while, while Mayhem 10 looks probably extremely difficult as it has all of them together. Now, I would like to see them expand on the system. For example, why not have Mayhem 11, 12, 13, and 14, where Mayhem 14 has modifier 1, 2, 3, and 4 be very hard, very hard, very hard, very hard. Well, that'd be fun. Or, you know, Mayhem 11 would be easy, hard, hard, and very hard, for example. So stuff like that, you know. I think that would um, that would make it more better, for example, if, if one of the Mayhem levels just didn't just have an easy modifier. Now, they did detail in here that the Sandhawk will return. I'm pretty sure um, everyone has saw that. And I can tell you from now, you don't even have to look at the gun. You don't even have to wait for it. It's going to be broken. Just think of it on flak. The Skull Masher is already busted. And that thing has f five bullets. And the Sandhawk has what? What is the detail in here? Nine bullets. Just think of it. A nine... Uh, and, and they go like in a, you know, it's like a pitchfork basically. A sandhawk is a pitchfork. That's that's what it is. Uh, but yeah, twenty five modifiers. It, it it talks about like encouraging mod. I don't know what what it's about. I do not like modifiers. I wish they can just remove them all together. Um, I don't know if they detail if you can earn them or not. The the mayhem was maybe I need to. Um, See, reading this tells me that um, that they're probably you're probably gonna get all mayhem levels all at the same time. Which honestly, in one of their streams, they said that you have to go through a gauntlet to get it. I heard that. I'm not sure if anyone can confirm that in one of their streams. Maybe I misheard it. Maybe they didn't say that, but I'm pretty sure whenever they're detailing that, they, they did say that. That would suck if you had to, you actually had to just get all of them all at once, because that would, you know, that, that wouldn't be fun. It's it's fun to go through every single Mayhem level and earn it. Even if it wasn't like a gauntlet, maybe go through Proving Grounds, for example. Um, of course, I obviously have some concerns. There's obviously more annoyments. Uh, they're also adding that. And it's gonna come with the cartel event, which is pretty nice. So I'll be linking the this thing down in the description. And this was just me complaining about <laughs> me, Mayhem 2.0. Uh, <clears throat> sorry about that. Uh, anyways, I'll see you guys next video. Thank you for watching.